Askins on Monuments is a program with projection map visuals on iconic buildings in the Civic District of Singapore. Refraction is a multi-dimensional trip through Singapore's architectural identity. And it's captured in the form of footages that we have acquired during Circuit Breaker of iconic buildings in Singapore, as well as the music that we have made inspired by the feelings that we were going through during the time. We hope the audience sees little parts, little patterns and motifs that they might see every day in a new perspective. It's obviously a huge honor. We got invited to do the National Gallery, which is the big daddy of them all, the final boss of projection mapping. Into Multiplicities is an experience that takes the viewers through transformed visuals and audio that's inspired by the archival material in the library here at National Gallery. I want people to think about why do we collect so much data? Is it like the fear of losing point in time or losing memory or losing things? Is that why we sketch? Is that why we write letters? Yeah, that's how this work came about. Jo actually came up with the first concept of like how she wanted to reference the Library of Babel and how information is being received and given out. So I thought I can actually portray that from a sound perspective. So we thought it was a great idea to bring that concept and that energy into the visual piece and into the music as well. The Askins on Monuments Mentorship Program is a program where we work with students from Nanyang Poly School of Design and Media where they create projection mapping artworks on the cross three facades in the Civic District which is uh, the Arts House, Asian Civilization Museum and Victoria Theatre. I was really surprised by the level of quality from the students, their storytelling ability, their sophistication in visual storytelling as well. is about identity. Identity is fluid, ever-changing. As we go on new adventures and meet new people, our identity evolves and adapts to the environment around us. I hope the audience will take away their own interpretations of the artwork. It's really interesting to know that they'll make up their own interpretations to really relate to our work in their own way and we hope they enjoy the show overall. Elusive Etudes is a facade and it describes a performing artist, their mindscape and how they are affected with this current pandemic situation. I really enjoyed the creative process. I personally was very involved in the character illustration and design, which I then passed on to the rest of my team for them to create our final project. It was a surreal experience. My parents used to bring me here five years ago to look at the projection mappings and knowing that my work is being presented to the public, it is just a wild experience for me. Pursuit is about exploration and we wanted to illustrate how you create the reality that you're in, so why not make it a little bit more enjoyable. Out of this program, I wanted to learn how to get a project all the way to the end. From this experience, I learned how to animate a 3D character. I was really daunting at first, but it's kind of cool that I managed to pull it off. As a young artist, this uh, project was the first one I had worked on with such reach. I think it really helped cultivate my communication skills, which is something that I hadn't worked on before. And I think it really helped me as a young artist.